lessons of wisdom as they relate to racing and time and money. If there was one of those six lessons that you, you could impart to the world, what would it be? I think the, the one most important lesson out of that is to appreciate the racing while you can do it. Um, I, I mean, I, I'm standing next to one of the greatest drivers in the history of NASCAR, and I can tell you without even asking him that Bobby Allison looks back at those days, and those were some of the finest hours of his entire life. And, and that seems to be the way with almost everybody that I know that can't race anymore. Either you run out of ability, you run out of money, uh, you run out of whatever it might be, and you can't race anymore. And I, I started a speech one time that said, if, if I'm on my deathbed and the Lord speaks to me and said, Bergren, I'm going to give you about one minute of your life back. What do you want to do? You can do anything at all in your entire life. And I would say, just give me one more minute in that sprint car of mine, starting in the back of the pack, hooked up, and passing cars. That's what I'd like to relive. Here's my point. If you're racing now, racing maybe on a local short track somewhere, and you're saying, oh, this is too expensive, it's too much work, I spend too much time in the garage, oh, I'm missing out on life, you're not. If you're racing now, appreciate it and enjoy it because it's one of the finest things you can do with your life.